फर्स्ट टाइम कलंगूटान इतना चेंजीस जाले आम लोक संगले एक व्यक्ति जे लोक खाती दीस रात काम करपी आज हम बरबर आसा मैकल बाब तुमका कार्यक्रम ये कहीं नमस्कार सगन पैली एच सी एन टीम वती विश यू मेनी मेनी हेपी रिजन ऑफ द डे जैसे आज तुम बर्थडे आसा सो वी वूड लाइक टू आस्क यू सम क्वेश्चन लाइक पॉलिटिक्स एंट्री कैसे गए हाउ इट वॉज वीन टू बी लाइक यू आर जेडपी एंड देन यू आर नाउ एम एल ए सो तुम्हें एंट्री कैसी जी पॉलिटिक्स पॉलिटिक्स एंट्री कर सोशल वर्क आज वॉन्टेड टू हेल्प पीपल Okay. Who are in need, okay. and uh, at a very young age, from the age of 14, I was helping a lot of people in my village, Parla. So finally, people recognized that I really want to help them. And with this recognition, I was forced to contest Zilla Panchayat election. I won that election. My Maka Bharatiya Janata Party, man, Maka. ब्लॉक प्रेसिडेंट तं कलंगूट कॉन्स्टिट्युएंसी ये कर नॉमिनेट के ऑलवेज यूज टू वॉच अवर ऑनरेबल चीफ मिनिस्टर मनोहर पर्रिकर द वे ही इज टू फाइट वेन ही वॉज इन द ऑपोजिशन बिकॉज आदी तो सदांत ऑपोजिशन आसो लक आज डायरेक्ट जिकोन ये रुलिंग आसा आई टू ऑलवेज वॉच हिम फाइट विथ द गवर्मेंट to do good for goa because janna janna injustice jatale janna janna scams jatale janna janna world bhrashtachara che ye open jatale he was the main guy who used to open this and he used to fight okay. for the state of goa okay. so I, i used to admire him i am i am i am from parra village he is also from parra village he is like my idol okay. and i have followed him okay and whatever he is doing you know like you know I am behind him. Okay. So I watch him very closely. Okay. How he does work for the people because they oh, say those who local adir kotha, those who local adir korum sotta, they ami shikta. Okay. And if for a amka delivery diu pak mehotale local. Kitli varsa dalle tumi enter korum politics and so being uh, MLA cha poili kitli varsa shi. Magadista. From the age of 18, I am actively involved in politics. Oh. Um, Doctor Vilik, I did my work. Okay. That is why I did my Trajan Baba work. Okay. When Trajan contested as Congress candidate, I helped him, and I gave him highest voting in Parra. That time I was just uh, 20 years old. And Doctor Vilik Haropa. Okay. And. दिलीप परुलेकर जिको हाड़पा फर्स्ट टाइम जेना पार्रा सालिगाव कॉन्स्टिट्युएंसी आसले आता डिलिमिटेशन जान कलंगूट गए सो माय हाउस इज इन पार्रा सो आय हेल्प दिलीप परुलेकर वीन आय एम वन ऑफ द फैक्टर मजे भाषे आने खूब जान आ सो आय हेल्प हिम वीन That time I joined Bharatiya Janata Party. What made you to join? Like, so we don't want to be politics. Naga, I mean, to this day, Bangladesh is politicized. No, yeah, we don't want to be into politics. But you came into politics and you made the changes. But See, what was the turning point? What made you to into it? Turning point was uh, I wanted to do a lot of work for my village, Parra. Okay. Parra was always neglected. Okay. Ani jenna jenna ho kam kurum phule sottalo. Jenna jenna arko rattale opposition. जे पंचायत रूल को आदि पारा पंचायत आड़को हाड़े बोर फुटबॉल ग्राउंड बनूंक सोता आज पंद्रह वर्ष पैली फॉर द विलेज ऑफ पारा तो फुटबॉल ग्राउंड बनपा चालू के पॉलिटिक्स मोदेगा स्टॉप के पॉलिटिशन्स होल ग्रुप केम एंड स्टॉप मी फ्रॉम डूंग दैट वर्क दैट टाइम आई थॉट लाइक यू नो इट इज वेरी मच इम्पॉर्टंट that you have to be up in politics part of to, that you yeah, are part of the politics to do social work inga sor kide ha jenna tu social work kottele kona hatir bore kide kaam korpa goitele tenna tu ka adko ratta lok lok sanmata kide you are aspiring okay. i was never aspiring i always wanted to do good okay. for others maybe in the field of uh, sports education okay. or any other field to do good work Road network infrastructure. Yeah. I always wanted to wanted like lot of good things should happen. That you are already uh, doing in Kalangi. Yeah. So after that, I had to join politics, and now 
uh, after winning, uh, we are trying our level best to yeah. deliver which was never uh, there for the people. Okay. And uh, what we have seen after roaming around Kalangur Contestant, it is very much developed and it's many works are going on. What is your main agenda doing that? Like road widening and all development works you have taken together and it See, is very fastly growing. Uh, Kalangut constituency, yeah. Adi Ahli and Ataha, that was always neglected. Adi Mujay Kandalim Kalangut Arparanagwa Parra Ata. This okay. is a coastal bed. Right. Earlier there was Nerul Resh Magush. Right. You look at Nerul Resh Magush, it's still the same. Slowly now the progress will start. Kandalim Kalangut Arparanagwa and Imparra. Okay. I mean, development start Kele Ata for the last two years. I have started the work. Earlier, for the last 20 years, it was neglected. Okay. The roads are right. not Lights are not There were no footpaths. Uh, beautiful beach of Kalamud Kandalim Baga was neglected. No parking. Yeah. No wide roads for vehicles to move freely. A lot of Indian tourists coming from other states of India. Yeah. Other, uh, that when they come to Goa, they visit this coastal belt. So when they are visiting this coastal belt, they come with their own cars, they need a place for parking. There is no, there was no place for parking. Ami Baga Bichajir parking place Kelea, near uh, Club Tito's parking place Kelea, Kalangut parking place Kelea. So we are trying to do a lot of things like Kandolin Beach beautification, Atami Gyopajara, Kalangut Beach are toilet nasle, the basic infrastructure. Changing room as well. Changing room, showers, everything we have provided now. Baga, there was no toilets, changing room, shower room, we have provided that. We have provided a lot of infrastructure, Wide, widening of roads are going on, bridge connectivity between Harpara Kalangut, which was narrow bridge, new bridge is being built. Okay. For easy, for a tourist when they reach in this coastal belt, they should be free and they should be given all the required infrastructure so that tourism grows and all the people of the constituency will grow along with the tourism. And I think uh, we are looking at it, something called entertainment park which is coming up in uh, Kalangut or Baga area, something entertainment thing. This is something different which is in Goa, we never had in Goa. So, so what is that exactly? Baga area which we are trying to do a small zone where people can come and perform. The land belongs to GTDC. Ingami 9 crore 50 lakhs motta, it is a central fund. Okay. Which came, think I'm a parking lot, a bench stand, a jogger's track, a beautification. Okay. And think I'm an entertainment zone. A lot of people can go and say a multinational company wants to come and do a show in Goa, like how they do sunburn or okay. that same spot as David Guetta shows are low. When I won the election in the month of November, David Guetta show was organized by Percept. Okay. On that same spot, that is okay. tourism land at Baga. Okay. So that is an ideal uh, location where there are connectivity of roads also from Arpara and also from Kalangut. Okay. And now we have widened both these roads. Okay. So it is going to be very easy for the people to come to that venue and get, uh, get a good entertainment. So okay. if that zone government declares that as an entertainment zone, we can also get permission to play music beyond 10 o'clock, that oh. is the uh, sound bench, yes, right. 10 o'clock person has the loud music. So we can, I think, we okay. government should try and get this relaxed from the center okay. till 12 o'clock, only for entertainment zone, okay. not for all the areas, only for, you have to create small entertainment zone like Baga, near Club Tito's Lane, okay. Baga Beach, Kalangut, Kandolim, you know, wherever there are densely populated pubs, restaurants, which can uh, which can bring in revenue for the state as well as for the people and still it does not disturb the people surrounding right those areas can be developed into a entertainment zone it's a uh, work is already started i think yeah work is started to create that and uh, that uh, that uh, the area okay to bring in infrastructure in that area okay but Finally, the paperwork has to the government and to declare that as an entertainment zone to get relaxation of sound, okay. to get other facilities over there. That is all with the government. So, till the government gives approval, you cannot go ahead with this big project. No, government has given us approval to do a 
Zone. Zone. Like if we are we are developing that area. It is a government land. We are okay. developing that area. Okay. At the same time, uh, once it is ready, like there, the government will allow to have a a, a show. Okay. A musical uh, show. Like so, X person, anybody can hire it and, and, and they have to pay to yeah. government and they can then hire Then, the time limit is still 10 o'clock. What we are trying to do is, Extra. I am trying to tell the government that this is a zone. Okay. So, let us work with this zone to relax the timing till 11 o'clock okay. or 12 o'clock. So, that they have to get the permission. The Goa government has to ask permission at the center and center has to relax this rule for Goa okay. in the interest of tourism. So by what period of time it will be ready to have people to enjoy that? I think it will take another uh, 8 months for this uh, zone to be totally ready. So after 8 months yeah. it should be open to the public? Yes. yes. Okay. Uh, Karangut is located as a tourism and again there are a lot of uh, drugs things going on and playboy thing you have also stopped it. How you tackle with all these problems? See, I feel like Drugs were there before I could become MLA. Okay. But the drugs in which way Mote Pramananje Salu Asle, they have been born. Okay. The government, our government, Bharatiya Janta Party government is very strict on this. Honorable Chief Minister is on record that I will not allow uh, sales of drugs, what was happening earlier. I will stop. So he has given clear instructions to police to raid any place to yeah. stop whoever is selling. In my coastal belt, that is Kandulim, Shinkerim, Kandulim, Kalangut, Baga, yeah. you show me where who is selling drugs now. Earlier, there were places openly selling drugs. Now it is not like that. Completely stopped. Yeah. Maji area, so circuits born as well. But there is still, okay. I am not saying it is like, you know, the openly unlap with a bond, but to a certain uh, level, you know, like it is still going on. Hide it. And the hiding steps you are taking to. No, I have already the informed the government. I have already informed the police department. Like, okay. you know, there are certain groups okay. who are there involved in selling uh, drugs to our local youths and all. You know, they have to take uh, more precautions. They have to put in more police force or gather more intelligence and raid these people. Okay. Do you get all support from government? Till today Ashtani. I have got good support from government where drugs are concerned. ANC is doing a good job. Okay. I'm the, uh, the new SPA, la. Kashyap. Mr. Kashyap. He is doing a good job. Then uh, Narcotics Control Bureau, yeah. uh, Rana, he is doing a good job. So I feel that our Goa police which who are there down the line, they have to start doing good job, you know, like okay. if, they, if they start, like, you know, like PSIs, head constables, PI, if they start cracking down on all these drug activities. So you are saying still they become, are not, still they are not doing that, that's what you want Yeah, means say. they are, they are doing their job, but yeah. the way they should do, they are not doing it. Okay. It will take some time. Government is serious. So the higher ranks of the police are serious. So coming down the line after six months or one year, no drugs in Kalangut. We hope that. Uh, drugs should be controlled totally. Okay. The minute you uh, you say you want to control, the whole government machinery is working. Okay. Towards controlling. Okay. Earlier, we drugs. We the government. Okay. Kalangut, Kandulim, Baga, my area was a heaven for drugs. Okay. It was easily available, openly available. Okay. Now it is not like that. 